All right, y'all, man, check this story out right here. This is breaking news. You're not going to see this story first anywhere else but here because you're here already. Just check this out, man. Trans woman claimed she had a one-night stand with Kevin Gates. He was eating me out. Trans woman named Leela Gibney is claiming to have had a one-night stand with Kevin Gates during a podcast interview with whoever the hell that is. She explained that she often DMs rappers with hopes of sleeping with them so they can pay her bills in exchange. And what that means is she finesses men, gets them to sleep with her, and then if they don't want the business to be out, they'll pay her bills and have her sign like an NDA or something, right? But Leela says she went on a dinner date with Kevin where she literally ordered everything that she wanted, including caviar. She says Kevin was staring deep into her soul the entire time. She even claims that afterwards, Kevin took her to his home and introduced her to Drika, his wife and baby mama. After a brief introduction, Leela claims she and him disappeared to his room where it went down. As for whether Kevin cared if she was trans or not, Leela claims the rapper said he was cool with it and even ate her out while she joked about squirting. Lord have mercy. I'm, I don't know what to say. I'm damn near speechless. Kevin Gates is my favorite rapper, man. You know, year after year, he does and says some wild things and... Am I am I about to say that if Kevin Gates is a sexually fluid rapper, that he's going to be the first sexually fluid rapper that I still listen to? Yes, I'm going to say that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry, man. Um, What that man does in his bedroom, it doesn't take away from the fact that he's still one of the five greatest rappers in the game to me. I mean... But this is just crazy because when you look, when you look at this Leela Gibney, it look like a man. It look like a man. You know, um, I don't. Kevin Gates is so wild and outlandish. It's like you really got to question if you really even believe this or not. And one might just believe that this actually happened. Because what reason does this trans woman have to lie? Now, I want to see if this story goes very viral. Because if it goes very viral, when it's time for Kevin Gates to drop his next album or his next project, and he's going to the Breakfast Club or Big Boy in the Morning or one of these places, they're going to ask him. And I want to see the verbiage he uses. To either admit that this happened or to deny that this happened. If he admits that this happened, you're going to see Kevin Gaines go to a way higher level in his career than he's been in. Because for some reason, when you uh, when you do the taboo stuff, you get promoted more in the industry for some reason. And if he denies it, you're going to see this Leela Gibney person come out. And call Kevin Gates out and maybe even have receipts. But that's all for now. I'll keep you updated on this. Tell me what's your thoughts.